A huge sinkhole opened up in front of a Las Cruces home last night, swallowing two vehicles and forcing the temporary evacuation of three homes. The sinkhole opened up at about 9.30 p.m. and authorities say it's about 30 feet deep and 30 feet wide. And as you can see, it covers much of the home's front yard, just steps away from the front door. Good evening, I'm John Purvis. CBS 4 today went to neighbors to get their reaction to what's become the talk of the town. CBS 4 at 530's Jacqueline Quinones is live in Las Cruces with what they had to say about the whole opening up overnight. Well, I'm standing in front of Yellow Caution Tape, but right behind me, there's a giant sinkhole that swallowed two vehicles, a sedan and a minivan. Now, I'm going to take a step aside so you can take a closer look. Fire crews and utilities have left the scene, but neighbors have been coming in and out to the area to check out the sinkhole for themselves. And neighbors I spoke to say they are now worried that this, too, can happen to them. Wow, kind of shocked because we live in the neighborhood, too. Our son is graduating New Mexico State, so he's been studying a lot for finals. And... He's a math major, so all that's going through, and he felt everything shaking at our house. The Las Cruces Fire Department says it happened at about 9.30 last night here on Regal Ridge Street near Enchanted Drive. The fire department says the sinkhole is about 30 feet wide and 30 feet deep. Luckily, no one was injured. The people who live here and neighbors from the nearby homes were evacuated as a precaution. One neighbor says she knows one of the residents in that home who was able to retrieve some items that were left in one of the vehicles. So her golf stuff is actually in their trunk, so I think they just pulled it out and gave it to our neighbors over there where they're living. The cause of the sinkhole is still being investigated, but Regal Ridge Street is closed until further notice. Now, uh, we know that Red Cross was called to help the family in that home as well as neighbors nearby. We'll keep you updated on air and online at CBS4Local.com. Reporting, reporting in Las Cruces, Jacqueline Quinones, CBS4 at 530.